welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. Fraz here as always, and yes, we're back for a little bit more. I've been doing some exploring on another file to try and see where things are in regards to things, because uh, although we have obviously discovered the... Well, to take this to the rocket, I believe. And let's just put that in there, put that in there. And uh, we need some of this, actually, because we need a... How do we build a repair tool, mind you? Repair tool, silicon, and some titanium. All right, uh, we got some silicon and we got some titanium. There we go. That was nice and easy. And we'll build. Oh, it's not in there. Tools. There we go. We now have the technology to repair stuff. Okay, so we need to drink some water. There we go. And now we need to go to the rocket, I believe. Cargo rocket. Okay, that's where we're heading. Let's go. Now, I do believe I know where, I think it's called the glow whale or something. You hear it, or you probably heard it in a previous episode when we were in, sort of, down near the alien sanctuary. You hear the big noises from, sort of, quite below. Um, we don't have the ability, we could go that low and possibly die. Because uh, we only have the high capacity sort of thing. So I'm hoping the Seamoth is possibly imp implemented. Because we will be able to look that out. Let's get across the water. So if you hang here... You don't seem to use too much oxygen. And we do have, I think over here, we've got the rock crab guys somewhere. Where are you? Where the heck are you? I mean, they are here. Just don't surprise me out of nowhere. Ah! There! Look at this guy! Look at this guy! Hello there, Mr. Rock Puncher. Now, these can basically cripple you in one hit, just pointing that out. It's a rock puncher! Let's have a wee look. So, rock puncher, large crusty, 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 I can't say that word, never can. Avoid or redirect with food. <laughs> it's like redirect, say, here, here, have a cookie, have a cookie. You want a cookie? Get a cookie over this way. Alright, now, I have seen where the rocket is. So, if you're wondering where the rocket is, you probably go here and you're like, where the heck's the rocket? The rocket is not here. The rocket is further up. Also, I don't know what these actually are. I need to work out what the heck they actually are, but the rocket is actually up here, uh, along with a base. Uh, hello, plants are deadly and vicious, and do they glow? They actually do glow. Okay. You see stuff up there? That's stuff. All right, so we just need to. I think it's this. Wait, I also don't know why the random water effect appears there. Very odd indeed. Through here. Hello, deadly plants. I always wonder why you're facing the other way. And there is somewhat a base. I.e. this. The mountaintop base! With all the goodies inside. Uh, let's just pop in here. Okay, right. So, it's time. We also have an empty locker up here for whatever reason. Uh, scan all the stuff. Now, for some reason, I don't know if it's just not implemented or to keep you awake. We discovered an office chair very up. An office chair, you know? But you can't go up here for some reason. I don't know why, but you just can't. It's like, no. But we will get a table, because, you know, tables are good. I know that. There we go, we've got a table. A very... Wait a minute. Why is it telling me... Sc well, we can scan the countertop. Looks like we've got some water there, though, in the med kit. So we'll take that, and we'll take that. Uh, wait a minute. Aha! The multi-purpose room that we can't build because we don't have the builder. But we should unlock the builder in this episode, I think. Uh, because... It does seem to be somewhat slightly related to how much you discover and kind of going around. The game seems to be on some sort of timer, almost as if you're unlocking things as you go along like, with the story in that. Uh, let's scan this. Haven't we scanned that already? That was a swivel chair. Not just a chair, it's a swivel chair. Yeah. We'll scan the shelf and get a... It's kind of amusing you get that music, it's like you have scanned the chair and get the wall shells, you know? And we'll get the amazing music of its discovery of wall shells. Because, you know. Alright! I don't know why that's black. 
Alright, so, if you're wondering where the rocket is, if you haven't seen it in videos before already, you walk up this way. And the rocket is hiding up here. Look, it's a rocket! Uh, in a very dark, dark area right now, because it's night time, but yes. This is the rocket. Alright, let's see. Now, you do have to actually repair the rocket. With our magical repair kit that makes everything work. Is that bit done? And I think there's a bit on this side that needs repaired or something. Nope. Open this. Uh, fling that in. Go over here. We need to repair the console. And launch the rocket. And away it goes! Fire! Now. On you go. On you go. Up you go. There we go. Oh, Jesus. See you later. Bye. Payload inbound, Vespa. Understood. If anything's wrong, we'll come get you. Hey, why not take a couple days R&R &R up here anyway? Why don't you take a jaunt down here? Remind yourself that life comes in colors besides white, off-white, and gray. And temperatures below zero. No thanks. But speaking of freezing to death, if you're staying on the ice, you'll need transport. You're trusting me with a snow fox. If I can find a version of the truth that authorizes it. You're amazing. If you're listening, Altara, she's amazing. Promote this person. Sorry, you're breaking up. Love you! So yeah, we will eventually unlock the no. snow fox, I think, as well. Now, essentially, you may be thinking, right, okay, so what else is... Basically, you just have to go and swim back. I was making everything yellow that we'd done. That's where the cave entrance is. Yellow is stuff with recess. That's our home base, and that's where... See, it says the cargo rocket's down here. It just tells you the island. I don't know if that is deliberate, or the actual thing is meant to tell you where it's meant to be. Oh. Oh, dear. Right, there we go. There will be a little bit of chitter chatter momentarily. I'm just gonna. I think we'll go back to our base. Um, because I think that's kind of like the idea. I love how the, there's. This world is actually huge. Like, uh, some people are saying Glow Wheels on beyond there, but there was something that's, the, you know, with the deep cavern that's like beyond that. It could be. Uh, I know there's the, like, the Sea Worm Leviathan. But I'm not entirely sure if that's even implemented yet, but um, we'll soon see if there's any story elements that pop up for us. Let's just head back to base, shall we? Look at that. Look at that. Probably could get some more additional water, so if we come and get a puff fish, bubble fish, whatever one it is, we should grab it and use it. Ah-ha! Uh -huh. Come here. Oh, there's quite a few. Stop trying to avoid me being turned into water. Not sure how it works, but it, it, it works. Just gonna think it's a fabricator and it's like Star Trek where it just gives you whatever the heck you want. Out of thin air. You guys enjoying your food there? I like how there's like things like that, the, e the, the ecosystem is ever going on without you, like, it's not just carnivores that will attack you. There's carnivores that don't attack you, which is nice. It is nice. Although it's nice when things don't attack you, so that's always a thing. You're yep. to your oh, hi. Yeah, Altera is listening. I covered our ass. And she's my sister, not my master. You do not trust your sister. Are you... Can you read my thoughts? Do humans think? Listen, I am <laughs> Do humans sing. And I would Ooh, love wow. to help you, but you need to get out of my head. If you will not return me, you must release me to another vessel. Love it. How? I am... uncertain. Your brain is restricted. I will inform you when I process the data. I'll keep Altair of her back still then. You were more polite when we met. Yeah. Process that. I will try. Alrighty. 
Now which direction do we want to go in? Because there's so much to explore. What is what is that shiny? I think it's just ice. Now how much have we got here? Right, so we've got the high capacity, we've got the fins, we've got the two... I felt like something just hit me there. Got some food, got some heating gel. Cold resistance 120 seconds leverages your own body heat to provide an additional layer of thermal insulation. Alrighty. It's like, hello. That's some copper. And some copper. Some quartz, because why the heck not? Just let's go around collecting up a few bits and pieces. Get some of these as well, because they're always quite needed. What the heck was that? I keep hearing things making noises and you're like, what was that? Because you never quite to. Ooh, hello. Penguin! Penguin! Come here! Penguin! Penguin! No, come here! Come here! Come here! Yes, I gotcha! <laughs> Trying to get the penguin is just like, yep, nope, nope. There we go. What the? Penguin? I feel like there's a Pokemon I'm going for, to be honest. So we've got the Penguin. Alright, uh, any more fish that we can scan? What about you? No, that's a bubble. Never mind. Leave the bubble alone. Have I actually scanned one of these? Yes, I have. Okay. What about the boomerang fish? Have we scanned the boomerang fish? Come here, boomerang fish. Boomerang fish! Don't you, don't you run away from me! You've been scanned. Never mind then. Do we have some salt here? What we're going to do is we're going to get some of that because that will allow us to get some cured fish until we get the means to make some bigger food. Ah, eyeball. Aye, aye. Aye, aye. Come here. Aye, aye. Right, so we're going to just head back to our base so we can get a little bit of food on the go because the cured stuff doesn't rot. So when you eat it, you don't actually lose like a huge amount of... Oh, I haven't scanned you. Come here. Hoop fish. There we go. Scanned hoop fish. So yeah, it doesn't actually take away like a huge amount of your, like your first, which is always nice. Uh, let's get some berries because it's always good to have some of them. A little bit of copper wire too. And let's get some glass because why not? And we'll switch over to some food. There we go, and we'll eat that, and we'll drink that. I just realized our water was already full. Okie dokie. I think we could just... What the heck is that? I wonder if we can get to that, actually. I'm very curious if we can get to whatever the heck the thing is in the... the now, how do we get up there? Hmm. Hmm. Let's see if we can find a way to this in some form, maybe? Let's see. Yep. Up to Daisy. Is there no way up there? Hello penguins! Hello! 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 What happens if I... Contractor Goodall, come in. Oh. Why are you being cute? I have the CEO on the line. Oh. Goodall, this bio sample you sent us, it bears no resemblance to your biometrics. I think... And the alien facility, it spoke your name? That's... What is happening down there, Goodall? I would ask your colleague, only he disappeared. I... Silence! Where is the other one? Here, sir. If you mean to make Vice President manage your people. Yes, sir. What is this, bien I said send you off. Sir, if I could just... He's gone. Sam, I'm sorry. I've been stuck in middle management since I graduated. I know. I'll try harder. I have to go. So, yeah. Hi. 
There is that, the fact that uh, now the CEO will know, so it's very intriguing to what's going to actually happen to Robin. It's Robin, right? Robin. We do have a range of new builds, because we've got the multi-purpose, we've got this, we've got all of these, which are always good. And But we don't have the builder tool yet, because it does, in fact, it's meant to come from the sky at some point. So we're just going to go and scan more stuff, because why the heck not? I think what we need to do, though, is we need to scan some more precursor technology. And now it says there's like 50 in the game. It does seem to be somewhat it unlocks as you go with that. So we're just going to go find the area to go down into. There we go. Down we go. Anything here? No. Uh oh. Oh no! So this is a bit of a bug for some reason. Basically, if you try and reload your battery, it does this. So we're going to actually give feedback. Uh, we've got screenshot, uh, bug. Uh, when replacing battery brings up options and not able to do anything apart from reload. So you have to reload, so I'll be back in a moment, folks. Alright guys, we're back and it does seem to be that that has somewhat triggered the builder tool action, which is even better. Which is this little guy over here, so let's head over and get it. Then we can start building and see what stuff is actually unlockable with the builder tool. Come on, drop it down. Drop it down. Which is going to be... That's way over there. You alright there? Oh! <laughs> it's just like, just like floating there like, mm hmm. Also, I notice that these actually beep when they come down. But, unfortunately, you have to wait for it to hit the ground. Oh my god, you're gonna go down really far, aren't you? You have to wait for it to hit the ground in order to be able to get it. So, with that said... Calling all contractors planet side. All Terra has updated mission objectives. Please study your individual briefings. Remember, failure to deliver on objectives will result in payment deductions and or your removal from the planet. Be safe. So, Activision, Search and Rescue, Jeffrey, Vesper's Orbital, GPS analysis, Kitchen Trajectory, toward, leading towards Deep Sea Station Kappa. Find your colleague. All right. Uh, Leviathan genetic research program. Gen genetic samples of deceased Leviathan research specimen required due to recent ice flow. Its position is unknown. Depth 150 meters. Why did I get the feeling that's not dead? Omega base was abandoned weeks ago due to increased local threats. Alien research data at the base may provide vital. It is less than 100 meters, so we need to find research base Omega. And you've landed. Excellent. Lo and behold, builder tool. Ah, yes. It's time to get bi building. And, of course, the blueprints are all unlocked. Look at all this. Look at it all. There's so many things. Yes, so it's time that we head back to base and g get all our resources together. And get some. Seconds. Yes, 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 I know, game. I'm going up. That's ice. We can't go through ice. We can build a little bit. 
Because Subnautica, like a good chunk of the building and stuff, but also the exploration, the, the story is much stronger in this version than the previous, which is great. And it was great before, so it's even better. But yeah, we're going to build that, and I'm hoping that the Seamoth is unlockable. Because that would give us the opportunity to go deeper, or at least some sort of higher capacity um, oxygen stuff. Because there's only so many plants down there. I couldn't see if there was any Titanfish, so I was unsure if we could actually do anything. Your way there, right? Okay, right, and we go. Okay, right. I require titanium. Right, I believe. What do we need for a solar panel? Copper. Do we have any copper in here? gold but no copper okay right we're gonna get rid of the quartz right now and then we're gonna quickly look around for some copper because we do need to power it you know it's kind of a thing it's titanium we'll just take that anyway copper please 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 titanium never mind we require some copper please copper where are you hiding Every single time. Although we do have a scanner, so we oh, hello. Have we scanned this? Yes. You can never tell if you scanned it or not these times. Come on. Copper! Excellent. So that's going to give us at least a little bit of power. Um, now, what I want to do is I want to place our base somewhere out over this like area. Because, it, well, one, it would be pretty cool. So I think think what I'm gonna do is where's that over what is this where'd this come from ah here looks like a sort of good point yeah we're gonna place it here right okay so uh, we need a lot more lead for that so we'll just place this just now so we can start things up Voila. Oh, I don't know why it's black. Uh, we need quartz to enter it. Oh dear. And... Okay. Alright. Back to the base. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. We don't want to lose this. So let's see. Do we have a beacon on us? We do have a beacon on us. So we're going to place that there. We're going to then just quickly come out and we're going to then place this here. Main base. Why is this not telling me I'm running out of oxygen? <laughs> and down we go. Processing is complete. Oh! You will build me a new vessel. How? What do you what mean kind of build vessel? you? I have not granted you permissions for that information. I can't help you if you don't tell me. Which data formats do you accept? Words, mostly. <laughs> I have added the information to your data bank. Thank you. Listen, I need something to call you. We do not use words that way. I used to have a pet barwell. I called him Ketchup. What? Don't make me name you two. You may append my seed code to the species designation. You may call me Al Ann. I waited my whole life to meet a space-faring alien. You're telling me your name is Alan? Is it insufficient? No. No. Alan. It's perfect. <laughs> Let me see about that vessel. So, there we go. Note, thanks for playing the Early Access 1. Story and gameplay from here on is broken and unpolished. So, bear that in mind. We're just going to probably just do a little bit of building. We'll probably do some exploration and then another, like, one more episode before then we wait for more stuff to come. Now, what we do have right now is we got that. Actually, we do have the solar panel access. We do have that accessible. Um, can we make one of these? Can we make a fabricator? Need more copper. Always with dang copper. In my other game that I've been playing to sort of like try and see about Subnautica, I I built a part of a base and then forgot where to put it. So that's a thing. Multi-purpose room. All right, we need to. I'm gonna just stick this on the top just now. Hey. 
Hey, hey, look at that. And then we go. All primary systems online. I'm gonna place this here. And then you can go inside and Welcome breathe. All right, now we want to start getting things done in here. Probably want a like a little bit of a locker system going on, of course. Let's get that wall locker. There we go. And you know what? You can never have too many wall lockers. Because usually what I'd do, like if you saw me play like previously, what I'd tend to do is I would explore and get resources. And we can't place another one there. Okay, you know what? Could you construct that just now? And you. And we'll put you over here. Right, okay, so you know you know what? We could just put a nice little plant here. Why not? Why not? Make it a little bit homey, you know? Alright, so we have a bunch of stuff here. Now, I'm wondering... Can you actually place anything on them? I have no idea if you can actually place anything on them. Uh, what we could do is build a bed. And I think we can also build some of these, yes. And we want to build it here. Look at that. Look at that. That is amazing. Alright, so we do have some of this. We do need to get more titanium, vertical tubing, uh, scanner rooms, titanium, copper, gold, table samples, table coral samples, and multi-purpose rooms. We need a lot more titanium, which we have a good chunk of it anyway. And back at the base! But yeah, I am kind of intrigued. I will probably look it up to see if there is a Seamoth. Uh, because it would be pretty good to be able to have it because then you can go deeper in the system and there is quite a an area below that we'd like to get at uh, da, 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 da. let's see take that take that got lead take that take that take that there we go back to it And ideally this will, because the reason we put it here as well, so you're not having to go all the way up to the surface. Not too much to the surface, but you at least have an area where you can explore to. Right, we want to, let's see, uh, lithium. Don't have any lithium right now. I mean, we could potentially put this uh, here. No, wait, that one there. There we go. And then, because if we bring that out to there, that's not going to be able to hold there. Scanner room would be good to get a hold of, yes. I actually just want to do this. I know it's going to reduce the that on that quite a wee bit. But look at that. Wait, you could put... I did not know that you could put them on the window. Can you actually put them on the window? You can't. Game, you lied to me. You lied to me, game. I'm just going to actually put this all over here. I'm going to put one at this corner. Usually you can fit four if you're very careful. Usually. I uh, think this one needs slightly adjusted then. Let's see. Let me put you right into the corner there. And you right next to it. Yes, we do have an area for it. There we go. Right. So that's going to give us that. We're just going to actually go titanium and quartz, just so we know where they are. So what I'll do is I'll probably next time is I'll come on this, uh, explore and get lots of resources so we can build a bunch of stuff. Uh, hoping that we can get this. Now, it does say the story elements are broken, but it did give us a little bit of data about, like, due to recent ice flow, depth 150 meters, uh, we do have station Kappa, uh, whatever that might be. So there is that, which is very interesting. And we do need to get some bulkheads or reinforcements. So we do need lithium and titanium. Uh, we do need foundations. We need lead. So with that, folks, I think I'm going to leave it there for today's episode. The next episode is going to be very much a sort of 
browse around, get stuff done. Can I place that in there? You can place that in there. Okay. Well, I kind of want to just place that there just now. So we know what we're building. Um, so yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching this episode. We have explored basically the story. So the next episode, if you're wanting to check out the story, then it's not going to be there. It's going to be purely a base building. But I think we might, if we can unlock the sea moth, we will go and see if we can find the glow wheel. If not, what I'm planning on doing is actually, I'll dump all my stuff and then we'll just grab the sea glide and go as far down as we possibly can to find it. Because if we die, we die and we don't exactly lose anything. Alright, well guys, thank you very much for watching this episode. See you all next time.